Hi, welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Moses KND. On this channel, I give ideas and tips of benefiting from internet and taking advantage of today's online life. If that interests you, please consider subscribing. So today, I'm here with um, uh, fixing a problem of uh, the picture DV lottery visa because recently when I was trying to apply, I really, you know, faced an issue on how to, you know, to get the this, uh, correct size that the they require for your DV lottery visa. So today I want to show you how you can easily earn that like just taking a picture taking um, a picture with your phone and just edit it with a with a website that will not give you a headache. The result will be instant trust me. I'll go on the computer I'll show you how you'll fix that. It's gonna be so easy you're gonna be happy if you've been struggling with this or oh, I'm sure when, if you're here, you're looking for the tips on how to quickly apply with no frustrations. All right, let's head on the computer. I'll show you how. Hello, hello. Welcome back here to my computer. I'm trying to I'm trying to show you how to actually uh, get the first time your photo, the photo for your uh, application, DV lottery visa application. See, when you're applying, you do need a picture here your photo where which they can put on your green card once you are selected but again if this thing i'll show you that gave me a lot like a lot of struggle i'll use the picture that we're going to edit to fit it like you see that picture there if i use that picture and submit you see what will happen you see the picture the picture is the problem how do i fix this picture that's what i'm going to show you what how am i going to fix this picture here you see so choose a different one still is gonna be the same so you need to go to e to this type this e green card photo because you the examples of the picture they want they should be like this in this you see a good picture background white you know clear this, these are the kind of pictures they want this kind of pictures they may not want them this is good it's not good it's not good so you just need to take your picture after you take your picture let's come here this e green card uh e green card photo tap in your search it's come here free passport photos for e passport so just click here you come to this e green card photo.com so they say here your steps upload so i'm gonna upload the same picture right the same picture we're using and I'll show you how to do it. Just make sure when you take your picture, leave a lot of room in the top on the sides so you, they can, you can have edits. You see, this is easier to edit because there's a room on both sides. So just edit this way, make sure this is the right way. And this website will make your resolution exactly that the one they want over there. So after you do that, just hit continue look this is how it's gonna look on your passport that's pretty good if you're happy with that with that picture and just do upload so it's right here it's uploading um, I think it's, it's ready and I open it let me open it and see should be good now Oh, you see, this is what they want, the resolution, the size and everything. So I'm just going to go here now. How about said? Okay, let's go back to our application, choose another photo. I don't see it. So that means I have to download it again. I don't see it. I don't know where it went. I'm not really a good computer guy. So I'm gonna go back there and download it again. I think we, I just did it, right? What is it, right here. I'm gonna go download it again. When it comes here for me, I'd rather just put it like right here. Just put it right, right there. This is a good one. Then after that, I go back to the application right here choose another photo I'll grab this guy and 
for the parade there. What is it? Right here. This is the one. And now I'm just gonna click on it. Double click. It's right here. So you see, this is the pictures they are looking for. It's just simple. Um, by this with this website, you can fix it so easily. Now, if I apply, I'll go to the next stage. The next stage. Look. You see. Now I'm here to verify my information. That was quick. You know. That was quick to fix. Now I'm on the next page, trying to um, verify my information and submit. Because this is uh, not the right one, I won't submit it. Is that is that simple, right? But you see, if I go back to page one, it's taking me back to page one. I'll choose another photo. You see what will happen. I spend so many minutes there trying to fix this photo. I was really frustrated. I almost gave up. You said they said I've already uploaded a picture. Let me see. Let me choose this. This is the same picture, but I just this is a good one that I've used the other. I have used the um, the website, but the same picture. If you upload there and hit continue down here, it won't work. The picture is very important there. It won't work. My, my internet is slowing down. Look, picture problem. You see, picture problem. It has to match. Has to match these things. That's why the megapixels, uh, the pixels, the size, and everything. That's why you need to to go search e green card photo and go here for free. I can even click there. It will take. This is the right one, but because if it's free. If you click here, you should be able to, you know, make sure it's the green one and the free one. And after that, you just upload your picture. So simple. Upload whatever, like even this one, we can make one, another one. You know, just wait for it to upload. Right there, they just apply them for you. Let's make sure your chain is right there. But this is not good a picture because the background is a bit dark and also it's not straight so i'm not gonna do that one i already have mine here which i'm really satisfied with so just gonna keep that and i go back here choose photo i choose that one and now ready I'm ready to apply ready to submit that's not too hard guys right not too hard at all and actually just make sure you enter this information within less than 15 to 30 minutes you see now I cannot, I need to refresh my page. Make sure you know you know what it is. So the way to refresh this page, you need to go back here. You see here, after putting all the information, before you hit submit, it's reload this information. So it doesn't, it's not allowing me. Try to go back so it can be like a new you know new application so yeah the the only way to avoid this make sure your information is ready and entered within 15 minutes if you go more than 15 minutes you suffer with this i didn't know the first time to fix it but i learned how to fix it i hope this is helpful you'll be able to apply you'll be able to apply for your you know to try a chance for your DV lottery visa 2020 to come up 2022 so yeah I hope I was helpful a little bit I hope this helps someone outside there all right I am signing out so this will always happen if you stay late without you see the only way to fix it, you have to go back and apply again. So I have to go back, put in the information again. So 
see it's gonna ask us to put information in again you know how to if this is happening make sure information is ready ready your passport is ready just enter all make your pictures on the side and do it again because if you you have to start from here this is the time the clock starts so within 15 minutes you have to finish if you're not done yet then it's gonna it's gonna be a really big problem remember make sure you just go e space green card space photo and such then make sure it's free passport photos and just click there and here you go upload your picture and do and do passport this one makes me really happy after i get to this page looks like i already got my passport all right everybody good luck whoever is applying wish you all the best all right catch up later on another video bye bye for now